just one example where this patient, who was not old enough to get an implant yet, yet needed something fixed because she wanted to go to college, and what we could offer her was a bonded type of restoration. Bonded restoration. Oh, you cannot bond to zirconia. Well, it's more difficult to bond to zirconia, but if you know how to proper protocols, how to treat it properly, it is possible. Maybe not as strong as to silica-based ceramics, but we have very good outcomes. Ten-year studies of zirconia resin-bonded bridges where we have no debonding at all if we know how to treat them properly. And this is where, again, the clinical uh, application comes into play. What you have learned from many studies, and we preach the same thing for the last 15 years, basically, was that you have to pre-treat the surface. You do not have to air abrade the heck out of these restorations. Small particles, low pressure to decontaminate and prepare the surface properly is perfectly enough.